Wayfinder. Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, what kind of disappointment? I'm also very surprised, probably as you are, because if you are following my YouTube channel, in general, you have seen already lots of interesting information about Wayfinder, new upcoming PC MMORPG, also available on PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5. And you can see here in front of you, this is team part of website of Wayfinder, all reviews for this game, which, uh, which was actually released for early access about 24 hours ago, mostly negative. 32% of 4,140 user views for this game are only positive. It's absolutely very bad situation for Wayfinder. And why? What is happening? Well, let's start the story with this. So originally, early access of Wayfinder supposed to be happened on August 15. However, just about uh, two or three days before, actually, look at this, one day, this is interesting, August 14. One day before, right, before that date, we have get this notification regarding delay for two days uh, until August 17. Now, just to tell uh, right away, this is nothing, uh, I would say it is a little bit awkward, but it's nothing too bad. We have seen also regarding many other MMORPGs in the past, right, that developers and publisher of the game, they have delayed a little bit a release of early access. Nothing too strange already, but here this was kind of bad sign. Now, you can see here in front of you, Wayfinder, one day when it will be released as a full release of the game, it will be a free-to-play MMORPG, right? However, for early access, you needed to buy one of the few packages, uh, the cheapest one for $20, this one for $50, this one for $90, or the most expensive one for $150. And there was lots of people who have buy actually this package, right, for $150. Now, on release day, right? Uh, well, I could tell you the story, a uh, long story short, huge problems with the game. Uh, people couldn't log in in the game. After they have logged in in the game, game have crashed, they were being kicked out of the game. And let me just show you some of the ex experiences, some of the comments here uh, on a Steam website, right? To make you understand what happened with, wait, with Wayfinder on uh, early access release day. So anyway, situation highly disappointing, right? And I have to say, I was expecting, I have expect much more from this MMORPG. So I was expecting kind of high quality and game itself actually so far was looking really good. Nevertheless, this early access is looking really bad. I have seen many early access, many games, many PC, MMORPGs, RPGs going into early access. And yes, usually early access releases are not perfect. There are many bugs, there are many issues. Nevertheless, this here regarding Wayfinder is looking really bad. Let's check some comments here on Steam to make you understand what is actually happening with this game within the last 48 hours. So first comment here, Positive review not available in your region. Also, $10 for 1100 room silver, but weapon cost $1,150. So you are forced to buy it for $20. Yeah, so this is often happening regarding pricing. Uh, developers and publisher, not only in this game, right? I have seen they put a little bit a lower price in cash shop uh, to buy some kind of package and they put some kind of weapon or item on a little bit higher price. So basically that one package for $10 is not enough. Yeah, usually they put that. So nothing surprising here. What a fail. You cannot log in because they managed to be naive enough not to buy, uh, not to buy enough servers. Best login screen simulator. Yeah, that was the main... Actually, I would say this was the main issue. Basically, people couldn't log in. So look, if you want, if you have already buy one of these packages, especially this most uh, this most expensive one, right? This is not a joke, right? This is not a free to play early access. People have paid money. They want to get something in return. And in return, what they get? Issues like this. So let's check further. Very poor server quality, wait for free to play release, don't waste money on this game. Uh, this is actually advice, which I will probably listen. Uh, I was thinking to play a Wayfinder, 
I was like 100%, look, I can buy this cheapest package, right? It's okay. And I will try to play it. It's a new game, PC, MMORPG. Well, my YouTube channel and my live streams are dedicated to new upcoming PC MMORPGs. So I was thinking, let's try to play Wayfinder, right? Something interesting, Airship Syndicate, uh, developers of this game, right? Also, publisher of the game, Digital Extremes. Looking like high quality game, interesting graphics, why not? But now, after this, I can tell you right away, I will not play Wayfinder. I will not play Wayfinder during early access. I will play it after free to play release and then I'll give you my review of the game. However, for this evening, I needed to show you this. I'm highly disappointed. I was expecting, like I said, much more. Let's check some other comments. You delay it and yet you still got an issue up on launcher where people can't get into the game so trash. I will ask for a refund and I will not recommend this game to my friends. Pretty reasonable, right? Let's check further. Paid for the game that is not even working. Also, nice cash shop which items, with items priced 1150 uh, bucks, but uh, packs give you 1100 or 2000 Yeah, this is, I, I, this is not surprising me. Regarding that, I'm not surprised. Update 1. Yeah, game is still not working. And if you try to find any info or voice, you are disconnected. Will botch a launch on Reddit Discord. You are being flocked by ships. Spamming, uh, that's the way it is, and soon that's great. Okay, let's go further. Uh, Baldur's Gate 3 or Wayfinder for <laughs> game? Yeah, I mean, I will not even comment that. Maximum positive reviews, capacity is reached. Please try again later. Yeah. I got to play the game, it is boring, sadly. Oh, interesting. This person have even one hour on record. So one hour, at least he can play for one hour, which is amazing. I got to play the game, it is boring, sadly. Combat is uninspired and the advertising media that was around this game was misleading. This isn't an MMO and you can't build, customize your hero. It is a cheap Warframe clone with tiny levels and tons of invisible walls. So regarding Warframe, game from Digital Extremes, it's amazing game. Warframe is absolutely amazing game. However, don't forget, Digital Extremes are not the developers of Wayfinder. They are only publisher, right? To be clear on that. And not recommended another pricing item slightly above empty packs is just bad. Again, this is nothing strange. Maximum player capacity is reached. Play, please try again later. Horrible lounge. Lots of early but much less access. Yes, lots of <laughs> people are so, a lot, sometimes these comments are funny, but yeah, this is funny comment, but actually clear. Very good. True, right? Lots of early, but much less access. If you have pay some money, if you have buy this product, you at least you could you are expecting to log in in the game. Later, a game can be good or bad, right? After you log in, after you try to play some game, it can be a good product or a bad product. But here we have different situation. People are not even able to log in in the game. Launches are never easy. I have participated in many launches of the game, many early accesses, many releases in PC, MMORPG, and PC, MMO game in general within the last 15 years. Launches of the game releases are never easy. Nevertheless, this is looking more than bad, right? Servers are down. I think people know this, but damn, this is a Discord full of toxic positivity. Really. I didn't check over there what is happening on Discord. People are upset that they bought something and it doesn't work. With full right, full right, absolutely. This is correct comment, right? You can buy something and it doesn't work. Come on, and they are being called entitled for it. Entitled because I want to. Uh, I want to think I spend money on to work. Jesus, people are such fanboys nowadays. Uh, you can read these guys for a while. Uh, there are some positive comments. Launch is still better than Overwatch 2. <laughs> okay, this is funny one. This is funny one, right? So. Many comments here, and uh, most of them are, are very, very negative, right? You can check them here on Steam. Let's check information regarding number of players. And actually, you can see here on Steam database, right, the Wayfinder. This is looking very bad. I was expecting at least, at least five times higher numbers. In generally talking, right, you can see here 24-hour peak, 11.1 thousand players. This is very bad. I was expecting at least 50,000 players. 
four times more, five times more minimum for title of this quality. Nevertheless, even now, uh, I can see like within last 24 hours, it was about seven and a half thousand players in the game. So I guess bit by bit, slowly players are trying and they are succeeding in logging in in the game. But I assume by this number here, players right now, 8,000 people, there are much more players who have buy one of these packages, right? And uh, they couldn't log in in the game. So let's check here on Twitter. What did developers and publisher of Wayfinder have right here regarding situation? What is currently happening over there on the servers? We are leaving the reduced capacity servers in place while our teams assess the situation overnight. This is not the start to early access that we had envisioned or what our founders deserve. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. This is not good. We'll be posting a full update from the team tomorrow about what happened, uh, where we are and how we move forward. We appreciate your patience and support. Whew. I mean, okay, this was a last post 11 hours ago on official Twitter account of Wayfinder. And for the last 11 hours, there is no other post. Before that, there was issue, uh, there was this post uh, 16 hours ago. I would never expect this. And like I said, I had plans for my YouTube channel and for my live streams to buy that cheapest package. I said to myself, okay, right, I will not buy these expensive packages. Come on, 150, no way. But okay, I can buy this cheapest package, right? I will try to play this game. Give it, give, I will give you my review of the game itself, right? Uh, content of the game, uh, features of the game and stuff like that, right? Nevertheless, after seeing this, 32% positive reviews, rest of them negative. Uh, very negative reactions uh, in generally uh, within other social media, no. I'm not, I'm not going to do that. So I'm also disappointed by Wayfinder. And I can tell you right away, I will not uh, play the game during early access. No, for sure. I will wait for release of the game. Free to play. This is supposed to be free to play title. It's written here somewhere, I think. Here it is. Tag free to play. Uh, this is PC MMORPG. Also available on PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5. So yes, I will try to play it after full release of the game by then probably developers of the game will resolve all of these issues right regarding logging in they will resolve these issues if there are some bugs in the game they will fix it so i will try to play it after release and i will give you my review of the game but until then absolutely no right so for this evening i just wanted to let you know release which uh, i was kind of hoping it will be something potentially Potentially really good. Potentially really good. You can check on my YouTube channel. I have made already a few videos about Wayfinder. And I was always positive about this game. I was positive because I was thinking this game have potential, right? To become something interesting. No mobile devices. This is not another a mobile port to PC. This is one real PC MMORPG, right? Uh, also for PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5. That's fine. No mobile devices, release on Steam, free-to-play title, interesting graphic design. You can, uh, you can see here, interesting graphic design, uh, lots of content to play. And in general, it was looking very good. However, today, just to let you know, big disappointment, uh, not only from me, but also from other people. I can only imagine who have buy this package for uh, $90 or this one for $150 and you cannot play the game. I would be really upset. Luckily, I didn't buy any of these packages. So, yeah. Let's see in the future what will happen with Wayfinder. For this evening, just to let you know, early access, a huge disappointment. Absolutely huge disappointment. If you are watching my live stream, let's go for a live stream. If you are watching this as video on my YouTube channel, thank you for watching the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Twitch to see more of MMORPG content in the future. I am live streaming every evening about 7 o'clock Central European time, so join me to see some gameplay and to find out what is happening in MMORPG and PC gaming world. See you soon.